Today's video is brought to you in part by Corsair. If you are looking for a nice set of wireless gaming headphones that will not break your piggy bank and still have a lot of nice features, the Corsair HF70s may be just what you are looking for. With features like true 2.4 gigahertz connectivity, a removable mic, easy to adjust controls, and solid sound, these headphones are perfect for their price range. The HS70 headphones work with your PC, Xbox, or PlayStation 4 and come to market at under $100. Check them out and see what you think. All right, so those are some pretty cool headphones. If you guys happen to miss the video that we did of them, we'll have a link down below where you can check them out. Now, today's video is about a product that is honestly for the person who is like the habitual builder. Like, are you a person who likes to put together those like giant puzzles with 500 pieces? Do you like to build and build and build and build and build? Well, because today the video and the product that we're gonna be showing you is all about a person who was totally like into Legos as a kid. Well, this is like Legos on, on, on drugs because it's just insane. Almost a thousand individual parts have to be put together to assemble this and it took actually it took Jesus the cameraman a couple of days to build this bad boy it was not easy I sat and looked at it and it was just literally bags and bags and bags of little parts so first off if you have any small children or anything you should not have them around this this is this is geared for kids that are ages 10 and up but honestly this is the my robot builder kit and this thing is pretty trippy because it can actually be built three different ways you can build it into a robot guy you can build it into a plane or you can build it into a dinosaur or you can build it into this silly little dog right here you can build it into this guy no no you can't i'm just kidding but honestly this thing is like really super crazy intense as far as putting together so let's jump in and let's check out this robot and all the different things that you can do with it because honestly it's not only something cool to like put together if you're like totally into that type of stuff it honestly has some really cool features and does some nifty stuff that you're gonna go hey that actually is pretty cool for something that's 135 bucks so let's check this shit out you guys will see that right when you open the box, there's a main engine as well as two high-speed brushless motors. The main engine is powered by a Cortex MX32 bit processor with a battery life of up to 12 hours. And thanks to the inverted pendulum algorithm inside, the robot can keep itself upright and balanced as well as move and turn forward and backwards. Then right off the bat, you're gonna see 978 parts. That's right, 978 individual parts that need to be assembled. And like I said, this took Jesus the cameraman a couple of days to do. Now, there's nothing really extremely hard about it. There's like great instructions. You get a full on book on doing everything. So it doesn't leave you going, oh my God, what do I got to do? It's just very time consuming, which is what I said in the very beginning of the video. If like you're a person who really likes putting something together and then seeing the end result, you're gonna really like this because honestly, that's exactly what this is really all about. I, I personally think there's a lot of cool features after you put it together, but for people who like to put stuff together and see the end result, I think that's where this product really stands out. And you guys can see that even when the filming is sped up, it still was very time consuming.
Now, once you get done building your robot, however, installing the app is as easy as pie. You simply connect via Bluetooth in the app and you can pick from a couple of different options. First, you have the path mode where you can draw a little path on your screen and have your robot follow it. Then you have rocker mode. No, I don't mean rocker mode like giving you the devil's horns rocking out, but this lets you control your robot with two buttons. You get forward, reverse, and turn left or right. You also get a little rocket button, which makes the robot turn and rotate its missile arms. Look out! You can also control your robot with gyroscope mode. Now this is a little bit more difficult to do, but if you keep doing it, eventually you'll get it right. Now, probably the best feature from a thinker's point of view is the ability to code within their coding algorithm. And when you learn that, you can pretty much make your robot, dinosaur, or your airplane do almost whatever you want. Almost. Within reason. Be reasonable. They also have tutorials. So if you're totally new to the coding game and you're like, oh my God, I don't think oh, I can do that. Don't worry, man. They got you hooked up with easy instruction that you can follow and get up and coding within their system very easily. The interface is pretty simple as well. With drag and drop code blocks, you'll have your robot learning new tricks in no time and all from your phone. Now, if for some reasons robots aren't your thing, why wouldn't they be? I don't know. But if they're not your thing and you want to build the dinosaur or you want to build the airplane, you can download those instructions right from within the app as well. You guys can see the My Robot Builder is something really cool for those folks who like putting stuff together and seeing the end result. And I've stressed that throughout this entire video because that's the kind of person I think that's truly going to enjoy this the most. The way that the robot can stand up on its own and move around is actually really cool. Haven't seen that on really any other products. And the fact that you don't have to build the robot and you can build a couple different things, that's also pretty cool, something I haven't seen. Now the price is a little bit pricier. It's $135, but like always, you get what you pay for. And if you learn how to code and you take the time, you know, learning to code can be actually a pretty fun thing if you really want it to be, because if you want to take that robot and make it do whatever you want it to do, all you have to really do is just spend a little time in there with that. And, you know, you can make it do all kinds of different stuff. So if you're totally into customization and doing that stuff, you can jump right in and start doing that. And if you're a person who's like really new to code and just want to see what coding's all about, you don't want to invest and really go to a school or anything like that, but you're still like, hey, I'd still kind of like to know what it is. This is your perfect opportunity to do that. Like I said, it's for ages 10 and up. So if you have really little kids, you probably don't want them around this particular product because the little pieces could get stuck in their throat or they could chew on them and swallow them and you don't want any of that happening. All you really want to do is have a whole lot of fun. Now, it took Jesus the cameraman a few days to put this thing together. I personally don't have that much patience. I would prefer to get the end product and just have fun with it. That's me. Like, I wouldn't really want to hand build my own amp either. I'd rather buy an amp that I know just works really good. You know, that's the kind of person I am. But hey, he sat down, listened to some tunes, and put it together. And as you guys can see, it's a pretty amazing little robot. So if you guys want more information about this, I'll have a link down below so you guys can check out more information or purchase one for yourself. Um, this company didn't pay me any money for this whatsoever. They just gave me the robot and told me to tell you guys what I think. And beyond the time consumption for putting it together, um, that's the only thing that I could say is a caveat, which that would be to some people who don't like doing that kind of stuff. But if you're the type of person who likes doing that, then honestly, for the price, I don't really see it having any caveats whatsoever. It's a very nice product. It's interesting. It's honestly really cool. It's the coolest little robot that I've ever had in-house so far. We'll see what the future has to offer.